Hey, what's going on, guys? How's everybody doing today? Doing well, I guess. Thanks for asking. Body beat down here. I say I guess because I'm really not doing all that great. You know, in life, uh, we get thrown some curveballs and fastballs and, uh, quite often. And it seems like some people just get it more often than others. And, uh, you know, my oldest son... I ain't going to give you all this business, but my oldest son's just going through a time and it seems like he can't just catch a break. Uh, he cannot catch a break for nothing. And, you know, whenever you're not rich enough to do everything, it's not fun because nine times out of 10, whatever the problem is can be fixed with money. And, uh, if there's one thing I can tell people, youngsters watching, as much as you hate to work, as much as you hate that money rules the world, is, and, and I'm the same way, it, it's a fact. You better get your little cards in a row early on in life and be prepared financially because if something can happen, it's going to happen. Our, our luck is... Our hot water heater messed up. Then like the next week, our HVAC system needed to have some, you know, maintenance. And now our cars broke down. So it happens to everyone. And here we are with a broken down car, kind of waiting on parts and waiting on stuff. Luckily, my wife is getting a ride to and from work right now. And I have a school bus. And luckily, we've been out all week. But, uh, you know. My transportation is a school bus, but I still need the car for running to the store and stuff. So, you know, we're all going through problems, man. And this, this world is not for the weak. It is rough. My son is, uh, he's got depression like I do. He's got deadly diabetes, the kind that will kill you in an instant. He's just having bad luck and... I don't know. I just, I feel like I need to say something on this video and let people know that, you know, sometimes what we do in front of these videos and in front of these cameras, you know, it doesn't represent exactly everything that's going on in our lives. And the one thing I try to do in my life and my videos as well is just try to be, I try to be honest. I try to be myself. Of course, there's a lot of times that I don't you know, show my true self because nobody wants to see all that. But for those of you out there that are really struggling, and I mean getting hit every other day or something, I feel sorry for you. Uh, you know, I'm 51 years old, and we still get hit like that. It still happens to us at our age because we're not financially stable. You know, uh, we weren't smart in our younger years you know we didn't save and we didn't plan and we didn't invest and stuff like that we just work and we live check to check and we work and we live check to check and you cannot do that i mean you got to have a plan you got to have a savings and you gotta when you get out of school you better do something immediately because life is going to kick you right in the butt so i just kind of wanted to open up the video today with that just because I got a lot on my mind and uh, it might affect my workout a little bit. I don't know. Uh, I've got stuff wrote down, ready to go. We're doing shoulders and back today. And uh, anyway, uh, let's try and get something done. We're going to start with some barbell shoulder presses. I had to move my rack out so I could get my bench kind of in position uh, because my spotter arms, my safeties are breaking and not safe and so I'm having to use my J cups and so I gotta scoot closer to the machine to the I gotta scoot closer to the rack you'll see uh, so I can use my J cups a little bit easier uh, so let's go ahead and get some uh, shoulder presses going and let's get this workout done and try to get this day over with so appreciate uh, everybody that's tuning in and watching and uh, that subscribes and don't subscribe and Leaves good comments or no comments or bad comments. I appreciate all of you. And I really, I really do. My heart goes out to everybody out there that's just going through problems all the time. And it just seems like the world is beating you down. 
I do know sometimes that it's our own fault, but I also know sometimes just life happens. And uh, anyway, let's get a workout done, guys. Okay, this is kind of trial and error. I'm not sure how this is gonna work out, how I got this set up, but anyway, uh, we got 95 pounds, we're warming up. We got 135. 185. We got 205, we got a 10, a 25, a 45, and the bar is 45. We're two twenty five. Two seventy five. Okay, we're moving on to barbell shrugs. I went ahead and called it quits on the shoulder press. Uh, there's no sense in going forward with it and trying to do anything else. You've seen me fail at 275. 270 is my PR. I'll probably never even get that again. And definitely today, I'm not focused and I'm not in the right spot. And plus my setup was different and so we're just gonna stop right there and go on to some shrugs. We got 225. Three fifteen. guys we're moving on to the back we're just going to do one movement for the back today we're going to do some barbell bent rows i'm not even warming up i don't even care right now it's one of those days where it's just one of those days <laughs> and 
Anyway, I'm not using straps, they're just on my wrist. Let's do 225 bent rows. this workout is done uh, I didn't do a whole lot of clips didn't feel like it and, uh, had a I had a decent workout regardless uh, even though my mind is not really on it right now uh, one thing I, I want to give some advice to young people not that anybody's gonna watch my videos that's young but if you're still in school or you're just getting out of school you better take this very seriously. You had better start out your journey in life and adulting right. You better go to school. You better go to trade school. You better go in the military. You better do something that's going to get you a career, get you set for life. Stay away from relationships for as long as you can. Don't have children for as long as you can because having those things to have to deal with always get in the way. Always. You better start this world, this life, your grown up life outright or you're going to be screwed, diddly ood, just like millions and millions and millions and millions of people are. We're included. We're a check to check kind of family. We live check to check. We don't have savings. We don't have uh, properties and businesses and we don't have nothing we're just a, a check to check family and uh, as soon as finances become a problem in your life your life is miserable you are absolutely ripped apart torn apart your family's torn apart you're all depressed everybody is just in shambles and crazy and life sucks and I'm telling you this is truth I'm 51 years old. I've seen it. I've been there. I'm seeing it with one of my kids. I'm seeing it with other kids. I'm seeing it with other people every day. I'm telling you. And this has this is what my channel is about. It's about keeping things real. This isn't the Instagram pretty pretty boy or pretty girl channel. That's not what this channel is. It's about real people and uh, going through real struggles and real people working out. And go look at the about, on what my channel's about. It tells you what we're about. We're a real channel with real people. And uh, we got real problems, guys. And sometimes those problems need to be aired out. Because somebody out there needs to hear it. And uh, the world is not getting any easier. The economy, people in general, things are not getting easier. So you better think, not today, you better think about 20 30, 50 years from now, because that's where you're going to be. That's what's going to be important. Right now, everything's great, fun, exciting, crazy, new. You're young, you're hip, you're awesome. 20, 30, 50 years down the road, you ain't nothing, okay? You ain't nothing to your school buddies. You ain't nothing to your friends that you've made, to your family. No, you better take care of yourself, and that is the truth. You better take care of yourself financially and physically, health-wise. And uh, uh, it's, a, it's a sad situation that my son is in. My son's not going to see this. He don't watch my videos. None of my family or anybody watches them. So but I'm not going to go into tons of detail, but he's just uh, he's one of those that just can't catch a break. And when he does, it's not for about a second. And a lot of it's his own fault. Most of it's his own fault. And, uh, you know, I don't know. It's a, it's a situation that we've been going through now for a long time, and I don't wish it on nobody. It is not fun. And I love my son to death. I got two sons. Uh, my oldest son is the one I'm talking about. 
love them to death and we have tried to do everything in the world we can. But when you don't try yourself, actually really try, when you don't put forth the effort and then every time something happens, you're blaming everyone in the world but yourself, nothing's gonna change. And, you know, threatening to kill yourself and can't wait to die and all this stuff, you know, that does nothing but make it look even worse. And uh, again, as someone who suffers from depression, me, uh, I think the same things every day. You don't know that, unless you've watched some of my videos where I might have mentioned it, but yeah, every day is a struggle. Every day is an absolute struggle, and there's days when I wake up and I can't wait to die, and uh, lots of other bad things. And then there's other days that I wake up and I'm kind of okay. So, uh, life in general, just life, plain life is not easy, but then you add on top of that depression, and it's, uh, it's just a world of crap. I will tell you that straight up. Uh, it is a world of crap, guys. Uh, depression is a weird thing. Uh, depression is normal everyday things that happen times a thousand. Your brain doesn't doesn't know how to handle things sometimes. You don't let go of things. Uh, everything is just crazy in your head and it's going nonstop. And it, it causes a plethora of craziness. I don't even know how to put it. Uh, but it is not a fun situation. And uh, anyway, uh, I gotta figure out what to do with him and figure out what to do with our car that's hopefully gonna be fixed this weekend. And uh, yeah, just a whole bunch of crap all the time, every day. And uh, it's the thing we call life. <laughs> and if you make it through, you know, a lot of people like to make fun of people all right, you're old, you're an old guy, hey, old guy. And then you know, make funny all the time, or old woman. Or, you know what, if you make it to old, feel lucky. Because there's a lot of people out there that don't. Number one, they just, they have health problems and they die on their own. Number two, they take their lives. So uh, be happy if you make it to an old age. And uh, to a lot of these kids being 35 or 40 years old. So appreciate it and uh, let them know how lucky they'll be if they make it to that age. So I'm sorry that it's kind of a, a super serious video, guys, but at the same time, I'm not. I hope it kind of touches somebody, and maybe if you got a problem, uh, you got serious problems, you can yell at me if you want. My email is mikeyson71, M-I-K-I-E-S-O-N-7-1, at gmail.com. I don't talk to anyone. Anything you tell me is in here and done. Uh, I've always been that way. I've always been the guy that people go to to tell things, and and I never tell anybody. Or we'll have something happening in the family, and I just don't even tell anyone. Maybe my wife don't know. She don't even know when we're having get-togethers or doing someone in the hospital 99% of the time because I don't say nothing. I just don't. <laughs> so anything you want to talk about, Personally, to me, email me. You can leave comments. You can do whatever you want. Anything you say might help someone today. You know, it might help save a life, which is what I'm probably going to have to do to my kid. So uh, not everybody's strong enough to keep pushing through. I'm lucky that I've been that way. And uh, I'm just too stubborn to go through with things. And uh, I hope to stay that stubborn. Anyway, guys, like, share, subscribe, comment to the Body Beat Down. That's me, Michael, if you'd like to. And uh, don't forget, get up, get out, get red, do it to it, even when you don't feel like it. We'll see y'all later. Get up, get out, get red, and do it to it.